This is the installation procedure for the Pemco Soft Close device for Box Track hardware system. To complete this procedure, you will need a tape measure, Phillips head screwdriver, marker or pencil, 5 64 inch hex key, 1 8 inch hex key, 12 mm wrench, 7 16 inch wrench, wrench 14, drill with a 1 8 inch drill bit, and a level. Remove the fascia and the end caps if applicable. Measure and note the clearance of the gap from the bottom of the track to the top edge of the door. This will be important later. Remove the in-track stops. Remove the door from the track by sliding the door off of one end of the track. Loosen the hangers from the mounting brackets using the wrench 14 and the 12mm wrench. Remove the hangers from the mounting brackets. Alternatively, the door can be removed by first loosening the jam nuts and unhooking the door from the hangers. Remove the existing hangers. Remove the existing hanger bolts. Install the taller hanger bolts provided. On the soft close damper, slide the catch towards the center of the device as shown. Measure the locations on the top edge of the door where the dampers will be placed. Position the dampers on the top door edge. Pay special attention to the orientation of the dampers as shown. The catches are installed toward the center of the door. The damper mounted on the left side of the door must have its catch point toward the front of the door. The damper on the right side of the door must have its catch point toward the back of the door as shown. Mark the locations of the holes to be drilled with the pencil. Note, the system may come with only one damper. Pre-drill, 4, 1 8 inch by 2 inch holes for the number 10 by 2 inch wood screws. Position the dampers and insert the spacers between the mounting tabs on the dampers. Attach the dampers to top door edge using the number 10 by 2 inch wood screws and the Phillips head screwdriver. Install the hangers on the mounting brackets using the wrench 14 and the 12 mm wrench. Slide the door into the open end of the track. Alternatively, the door can be reinstalled by first sliding the hangers back in the track. Hook the door back on the hangers. Tighten the jam nuts and hanger nuts using the 12 mm wrench and the wrench 14. Adjust the door until it is level. Choose the appropriate activator pin by using the recorded clearance information you gathered in step 4 and the range of distances stated in this step. Install the appropriate activator pin on the end of the rod as shown using the 5 64 inch hex wrench. Perform this step on both activator assemblies if applicable. Install the activator assembly into the track as shown. Be sure that the activator pin is pointing towards the center of the track. Install the second activator assembly if applicable. Ensure the bottom base portions of the activators are in line with the door edge when the door is in the open closed position. Tighten the activator bolts using the 7 16 wrench. Perform this step on both activator assemblies if applicable. Locate the set screws at the bottom of the activator assembly with the 1 8 inch hex key. Fasten the set screws to secure the activator assembly to the track. Perform this step on both activator assemblies if applicable. Move the door to the open or closed position. Ensure the proper engagement between the activator pin and the soft closed damper. Adjust the location of the activator assembly as needed. Apply. 1. Foam tape to the fascia as shown if applicable. Apply the second foam tape to the wall as shown if applicable. Replace the fascia and the end caps if applicable. This concludes the installation procedure for the Pemco Soft Close device for Box Track Hardware System.